Hello, everyone. This is Archive of 12, and I had someone recommend this to me. Uh, they sent me this video. It was just like a one minute, like one minute, 15 second snippet on TikTok. Uh, and this is if Creed wrote Evanescence's Bring Me to Life. And I got to admit. The moment I started hearing it, I stopped the video that was on TikTok because I knew I wanted to react to it. As far as I'm aware, this is the full song, not just a snippet. So I'm very much excited to hear what these two individuals, um, Steve Welsh and Mac Glocky, have to do and have to say about this, because I, I have never heard e either one of these guys. So this should be this should be very interesting. Link will be in the description below if you want to watch this without my commentary, because we'll be pausing and I will be talking about it. And without further ado, let's get started. I've been very excited to hear what the rest of the song sounds like. If Creed wrote... Steve. Mac. If Creed wrote, bring me to life. <laughs> the little hand. The little hand. <laughs> Bro. Yes. This is the part I've heard. Already, it sounds like a Creed song, just right off the bat. How can you see I hit the stop button by accident. So oops on me on that. What? How? How? Just how? Okay. Now, I'm not I'm not unaccustomed. Okay, I'm not unaccustomed to musicians taking other musicians songs and turning it into a different style. Anthony Vincent did that to one of my and one of my favorite songs that uh, that he's done was um, Bad Blood. I think it's Bad Blood from Taylor Swift in the style of Disturbed. And oh, my God, does it work? But I never in my wildest dreams. N never would I have thought that Creed singing the Evan Essence song in the style of Creed would sound this good. Now, obviously, this isn't Creed, but Steve Welsh sounds so good. Like, if, if I were to listen to this on Spotify, I would not be able to tell the difference. 100%. Hands down. I would not be able to tell that this wasn't Creed. This sounds like a Creed song. This sounds like this is how Bring Me to Life should have sounded. And I'm not, I'm, that's not a disrespect on Evanescence. As a millennial, I grew up with Evanescence, okay? My high school years were dominated by Evanescence. But they were also dominated by Creed. So, like, this, this just fits. Why does it fit? How? 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 Okay? Tell me, someone, please explain this to me. How does this sound like it should have always been a Creed song? 
Why does this sound like this never should have been anything but a Creed song? And again, I, I mean no disrespect to Evanescence because they 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 this this song dominated just about every millennial that I've ever met, like young adulthood. But why does it sound like it should have always been a Creed song? I'm never going to be able to listen to this song the same way again. I'm never going to be able to listen to Bring Me to Life the same way again. How does this sound so good? Like, I know I'm not really saying much beyond that, but that's because I am flabbergasted, okay? The way that these two sound like Creed, the way that they have managed to perfectly replicate Creed's sound is astounding me okay the instruments the instrument uh, the instrumental it sounds damn near perfect maybe a little off here and there but you know what as a cover band as a cover duo you, you sounds close enough that i'd never know like i said if i listened to this on spotify i would never have guessed that this was uh a uh uh, this was this, this wasn't Creed, okay? This is just shocking me. Okay, this is this is I, I am absolutely shook right now. I, I have goosebumps. That's that's how much of like my millennial nostalgia is like activating and going haywire because this is something that should never have happened and yet it has happened in my lifetime, and I am so thankful for it but I am also so confused. I definitely want to listen to more of these songs. If you guys know of of, uh, you know, Mac Glocky and you guys have a personal recommendation, please let me know and I will react to it. I'll probably choose random ones every every once in a while, kind of what I do with uh, like um, Fury Hard Productions and just like choose some and react to it randomly. But if there's a specific song in his library that you find that you want me to react to, please let me know in the comments below because I want I want some recommendations. OK, I want to know what you guys want to see and what you guys want to hear. So just wow. But anyway, that's going to be it for me. I I have so many goosebumps right now, but uh, and it, <laughs> Yeah, thank you for joining me on this very wild ride. I am Mark Alpha 12, and I will see you in the next video.